Happy New Year! This is officially my first video of 2023. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're just joining, if you're just joining this family, thank you, thank you so much for being a part of this family. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you for tapping on the link and watching. Thank you. So guys, it's going to be, I don't know how this video is going to be, but so I'm about to do something new, something I haven't done before and I'm like, mm, why not, you know, why not record it for documentation purposes, for documentation purposes and then for you guys, tell me what you think. So uh, today I'm going to try making shawarma for the first Let's time. Let's quick backstory, yeah. There was a time in my life when I was somewhat addicted to shawarma. I won't say addicted, addicted, but shawarma was like my, um, I don't know how to even put it, my, like when I'm hungry, can't jump into the kitchen kind of meal. It was, it was like my recourse. Yes, let me put it like that. It was my recourse. Like once I know I can't jump into the kitchen, I just pick up my phone and I'm ordering shawarma, right? Maybe because um, I stay in an environment where it was very, very easy to get, and I mean good shawarma. But even at that, I tried shawarma from different places. I'm like, this one is just, just manageable. But for some time, for some months now, I haven't really, I've not had shawarma in a very long time, like in a very long time. And yesterday I was just thinking about it and I was like, okay. Let me make it. So there are there are million and one shawarma recipes online, even here on YouTube. Um, I watched some, and <laughs> I'm gonna give it a shot. I'm gonna give it a shot. <laughs> so I'm going to make a shawarma today. I'm going to take you guys along the process procedure. Apparently, I was supposed to start. I was supposed to start this morning, but. I don't even know. I um, had already marinated the chicken this morning. I had marinated the chicken this morning. Like, I soaked it in the marinade, but I was supposed to like film, you know, everything I put together. But it, I, I didn't remember. I didn't pick up my camera all the time. <laughs> but I'll just show you guys what it is and tell you what and what I put into it. And yeah, I'll take it from there. So, to see the end result of this, to see whether it's a disaster or it came out, you know, on point. Keep watching and please don't skip ads, guys. Please don't skip ads, please. please. Your girl needs it. So anyway, let's jump right into our shower making process. So guys, this is chicken already. Um, I'd dipped it hard in. Um, Suya pepper, I think this makes a suya pepper, ginger garlic powder, um, what else? Paprika, salt, um, stock cubes, um, what else did I have inside? Cayenne pepper, and um, I think that was all. I think that was all I did for this marinade. Yeah, um, chicken flavor, that's all. Shawarma bread. Veggies to be used for shawarma. <laughs> Shawarma's coming up. <laughs> A more shawarma sauce, and I have ketchup to go. Yeah. So let's start making shawarma. Let's start making shawarma. Right. Frying with non-stick pan. That chicken breast. Um, that had marinated already, so I tried frying with non stick pan, but it wasn't working for me. I guess I was <clears throat> I was just um, paranoid or feeling insecure. I was feeling like it, it, like it wasn't going to cook well, like cook inside because outside was already looking fried, and I was afraid that it didn't cook well inside. So I transferred to the oven. Take a look. Okay, while that is taking place, I like to work on my vegetables, yeah, right about now. So yeah, I'm also going to be using sausages. Oh, 
so guys right after wrapping i um, put it into my non-stick pan to pan fry for some seconds and it came out really really good tasted really really nice and i had great reviews from hobby and his friends as they had it thank you for watching i really enjoyed creating this video i'll see you in the next one welcome to lolita's veal So guys, right after wrapping, I um, put it into my non-stick pan to pan fry for some seconds and it came out really, really good. Tasted really, really nice and I had great reviews from Hobby and his friends as they had it. Thank you for watching. I really enjoyed creating this video. I'll see you in the next one.